Think the Dutch landscape is just flat fields dotted with windmills? Or that the only thing on the menu is cheese? And let's not forget about the infamous reputation for tulips and liberal laws. But there's so much more to uncover about Dutch culture, food, and daily life. Get ready to challenge everything you thought you knew about the Netherlands. Today, we're tackling some of the biggest myths and misconceptions surrounding this unique country. So, are you ready to see the Netherlands in a whole new light? Let's get started. 21. Everyone smokes weed. The Netherlands has a well-known policy of tolerance toward cannabis. However, data suggests that cannabis use in the Netherlands is in line with other European countries and not as prevalent as the stereotype suggests. The Dutch approach aims to separate the market for soft drugs from hard drugs and reduce the risks and nuisance of drug use. Cannabis is sold in licensed coffee shops, but public consumption is often restricted. 20. The Netherlands and Holland Historically, Holland refers to two provinces west of the Netherlands, North Holland and South Holland, which include major cities like Amsterdam, Rotterdam and The Hague. However, the Netherlands encompasses all 12 provinces of the country. The confusion comes from the prominence of Holland in the Dutch Golden Age, leading to the name being used as a synonym for the whole country. 19. Flat as a pancake. While the Netherlands is famous for its flat landscapes, which are ideal for cycling and have necessitated innovative water management techniques, it does have varied geography. The province of Limburg in the southeast, for example, features rolling hills, and the value area contains forests and heathlands. 18. Dutch and German are the same language. Dutch and German are both part of the West Germanic language family, but they are distinct languages with their own grammar, vocabulary, and pronunciations. While there are similarities due to their common roots, speakers of one language cannot automatically understand the other without learning it. 17. Tulips are native to the Netherlands. Tulips are synonymous with the Netherlands, especially given the country's reputation for flower cultivation and export. However, tulips are originally from Central Asia and were introduced to the Netherlands in the late 16th century. The Dutch quickly became renowned for their tulip cultivation, leading to the infamous tulip mania in the 17th century, considered one of the first recorded speculative bubbles. 16. English isn't widely spoken. The Netherlands is known for its high level of English proficiency among non-native speakers. This proficiency is reflected in the country's education system, where English is a mandatory subject. Many universities offer programs in English to attract international students, contributing to the widespread use and understanding of English. 15. It's always raining. The Netherlands has a temperate maritime climate characterized by mild winters and cool summers, with precipitation evenly distributed throughout the year. While it may seem like it rains a lot, the total rainfall is comparable to that of much of Europe. The weather can be unpredictable, but there are plenty of dry and sunny days, especially in spring and summer. 14. All Dutch people are tall and blonde. The Dutch are often cited as some of the tallest people in the world on average, a trait thought to be influenced by genetics and a high-protein diet. However, the country is ethnically diverse, especially in urban areas, due to immigration and its colonial history. This diversity means not everyone fits the stereotype of being tall and blonde. 13. There's no crime in the Netherlands. The Netherlands is known for its high quality of life and relatively low crime rates. However, like any country, it experiences crime, including theft, burglary, and cybercrime. The Dutch police and judicial system work actively to maintain public safety and address crime through prevention, enforcement, and rehabilitation programs. 12. Windmills are just for tourists. Windmills have been an essential part of Dutch history and landscape, serving practical purposes such as pumping water out of low-lying land and grinding grain. Today, while many windmills have been preserved as historical monuments and indeed attract tourists, their existence is deeply rooted in Dutch culture and engineering. 
Some still serve their original purposes alongside modern wind turbines that generate renewable energy. 11. Prostitution is legal. Everywhere. Prostitution is legalized and regulated in the Netherlands to protect sex workers and reduce crime associated with the sex industry. However, it's not legal everywhere, but confined to certain areas and under strict regulations. For instance, Amsterdam's red light district is the most famous area where prostitution is openly practiced. Municipalities have the authority to issue licenses to brothels and regulate the industry within their jurisdiction. 10. The Dutch are rude. This perception often stems from cultural differences. The Dutch communication style is typically direct and straightforward. This directness is a cultural norm and is not intended to be rude, but rather to promote clear communication and honesty. In business and personal interactions, this means that Dutch people tend to get straight to the point. 9. The Netherlands is only good for party tourism. While cities like Amsterdam are famous for their nightlife and liberal policies on cannabis, the Netherlands offers much more. The country is rich in art, history and culture, with numerous museums, historical sites and architectural marvels. It also boasts beautiful natural landscapes, from the tulip fields in spring to the beaches along the North Sea coast and the national parks. 8. Cheese is the only Dutch food worth trying. Dutch cuisine may not be as globally renowned as some other countries, but it has its unique dishes and flavors. Traditional Dutch foods such as stampot, a dish made of mashed potatoes mixed with vegetables, herring, raw herring, and snert, pea soup, are worth trying. Dutch pastries and sweets like stroop waffles, syrup waffles, and poffertjes, mini pancakes, are also delicious. 7. The country is liberal in every aspect. The Netherlands is known for its progressive policies on issues like drugs, same-sex marriage, and euthanasia. However, like any society, there's a spectrum of political and social opinions among its population. The country has both liberal and conservative political parties, and recent years have seen debates on immigration, integration, and national identity reflecting a range of viewpoints. 6. Bicycles have the right of way everywhere. While the Netherlands is incredibly bike friendly with extensive cycling paths and laws that often favor cyclists, there are rules that cyclists and motorists must follow. Cyclists are encouraged to follow traffic signals and signs. And while they do have the right of way in many situations, this is not universal. Five. The Netherlands has no cultural diversity. The Netherlands has a rich history of immigration, contributing to a diverse cultural landscape. Major cities like Amsterdam, Rotterdam, and The Hague feature a mix of cultures from around the world reflected in the country's food, festivals, and everyday life. The Dutch colonial history also contributes to this diversity. 4. Dutch art is only about Van Gogh and Rembrandt. The Dutch Golden Age in the 17th century was a period of great wealth and cultural achievement, producing famous artists like Vermeer and Frans Hals, in addition to Rembrandt. The Netherlands has also made significant contributions to modern and contemporary art, with figures like Piet Mondrian and movements like De Stijl. 3. It's illegal to drink in public. Public drinking laws vary across the Netherlands, with some cities having designated areas where consuming alcohol in public is allowed, while others may impose fines for public drinking outside these zones. These regulations are often in place to prevent nuisance. 2. Everyone lives below sea level. A significant portion of the Netherlands is below sea level, necessitating innovative water management techniques, including the famous Dutch dikes, pumps, and canals. However, not everyone lives below sea level. There are areas, particularly in the eastern and southern parts of the country, that are above sea level. 1. It's a giant tourist trap. While certain areas, particularly in central Amsterdam, can be very touristy and crowded, the Netherlands is much more than that. Many places offer authentic Dutch experiences without the crowds, from smaller towns and villages to the countryside's natural beauty. 
It's clear that the Netherlands has much more to offer than what meets the eye. If you've enjoyed debunking these misconceptions with us and discovering the rich tapestry of Dutch culture and history, don't forget to hit that like button. Your support means the world to us and helps us bring more content like this to you. And if you haven't already, make sure to follow or subscribe for more insightful videos that explore the realities behind popular myths from around the globe. Have thoughts or questions about what we covered today? Drop us a comment below. We love hearing from you. Until next time, thank you for watching.